talk about Holy Grail. Apparently, this is the mojo that we're thinking got that. Uh, that keeps this yeah. from having sludge. Sludge. So tell me about the mojo in this thing. Huh? So we take a very small amount of engine oil from the pressure in the system. Right. And we run it through this canister. Filter. I like that canister. That's uh, that's really that's a nice piece of aluminum with a nice O-ring installed in there. Yep. So the Love oil that. comes up through the middle, uh -huh. pushes down through the bottom. It's a progressive filter, so it starts at 10 microns and works all the way down to one by the time it comes out of the bottom. Now we're going to go ahead and address this because people on the internet just like to, you know, this this looks like, you know, <laughs> it's not a roll of <laughs> I can I, I can see that, but I wanted you to yeah. make sure that we we, we stated that out loud. Yeah. And this is a, how small of a micron? One micron. One micron. Wow. Yep. And so you're not doing the entire. It's not like this is a secondary um, kidney loop. What, what? It's a kidney loop. It takes a slipstream of oil uh -huh. from the pressurized side of your engine, right. pushes it through the filter, and then dumps it back in the top of the engine down to one micron. This is synthetic fiber material, not paper. Yeah. Yeah. This is really pretty nice. You get a lot of flow up through there with the way you've got that uh, just cut all out in the bottom. And the installation is relatively simple. You take a, a pressurized port, you run it into which which one of these? Uh, this is in. Yeah, you've got it marked in. Yeah, ah, smart for dummies like me. <laughs> so you put the pressurized oil in here, and then you put this. And this is almost so small, it's kind of like just a, a, a little squirt back in here, yeah, right? Yeah, it's a very slow flow. So okay. You don't take too much from the sun. We actually sell these on our website just for the people to know. You order them specific to your vehicle. Yes. Yeah. And is this is an aluminum filler, filler cap? Yep. Yeah. Dude, that's worth the thing alone. You get a nice cap. I so like that's that. where it comes out of the filter. Gotcha. And dumps right back down your filler neck. So the best place the to put that is just an easy place to get to it yep. under the hood. Yep. And this bracket is pretty dang simple and universal and yep. work. And there's so some of them come with the U-shaped bracket, for uh -huh. instance, the 6-7 power stroke, ah. and yet there's no room under the hood, so you have to mount it on the frame. So it can come with a frame mount bracket that you utilize these two So you've already figured out, frame. like, mount it here, mount it there yep. on, on every... Great. Awesome.